And then that brings us to the dark period of Buddhism in China. While it had its heyday in the 6th, 7th, 8th century, uh, with Emperor Wu Zong, we see three years of persecution of Buddhism, 842 to 845. He will destroy 4,600 monasteries and force monks back to work on the advice of his Taoist uh, scholars who uh, urged him uh, to think of removing black or Buddhism from China would lead to an immortal life for the emperor. And then sociologically, the Chan sects tended to live in the distant forest monasteries they survived. And the Pure Land traditions so popular among peasants were kept alive because of the peasants. But the elite schools that established themselves in the rich urban monasteries of China will largely be destroyed in this period along with, for example, Tantric Buddhist traditions will disappear uh, during this persecution period.